everybody and welcome back to another episode of Building with Sausage. This is Mythical Sausage here. Hello. What's up everybody? We're back here again in our tutorial world. We're about to be doing a very, very cool build, a requested build. Multiple requests for this build and it's very tiny but it's very nice. Okay, but if you guys want to check out any of the previous builds behind us, there's always links in the description of this video. Go down there, check it out. There's a bunch of cool ones all the way down there, bro. Amazing stuff. Amazing stuff. And today we're going to be using our boy Germs, a boy's texture pack. If you want to also down that. Down Download that. I just turned British. If you want to download that, it's also in the description. Check it out. It's amazing. One of my favorites. It's not the best vanilla pack there is in the world. But today, we're going to be doing a market stall. It's right here. There it is. Look how cute. Look how tiny. Look how nice. Imagine having this. You can even make a bunch of these in a row, continuous, down a row, down that way, down that. Go crazy. But look at this little concept of a little tiny uh, market stall. And I did some banners. Look how cute those banners are. I like those. Uh, if you want me to do a tutorial on those, let me know. Uh, but look how cool. Look how much stuff you can fit inside here. Look at this. Look at this. The details on the roof, though. Um, that ceiling is crazy. Uh, but we can put a bunch of stuff, put little carpets, hidden glowstone on the bottom. Uh, two stalls here, back to back. You can make it one big stall, too. Just get rid of the middle part. Or you can even live, leave uh, the middle part. Hello, trapdoor. You can even leave the middle part and just break this little piece off as one big one. Uh, but I made it into two little uh, baby separate ones. But it's all modular. So you can go ahead and just attach it and do a bunch in a row if you want. But let's get this started. This is the materials we're using. I'm going to be using some oak wood logs, some dark oak slabs, some dark oak stairs, some uh, spruce stairs, spruce wood slabs, some trap doors, walls, uh, oak fence, and bringing a couple things along the way. But let's get our first block of the day going. Right here. I'm going to drop it right next door. Bam. Look how cute. Actually, I'm going to do a space of three and do another. Bam. No. Right here. Bam. That's a good spot. <laughs> okay. So this is pretty cool. This is if you would do two separate ones next to each other. Uh, and that's enough space uh, so I could put. Actually, let's do one more space just in case. Okay. Perfect. Let's one block of the day. Let's go. So now, next up, let's just go up by two on that. All right. Give it a space of two. Drop another log up by two. Another space of two. Another log up by two. And now underneath this, let's do a little cross beam action right there. Perfect. Okay. Now. Come this way. Let's do a space of three. Drop this one, two, three up. Knock this down and do another cross beam action. All right. Do it again. Space of two. Bam. We're mirroring that. Space of two. And then we have this space of three. And underneath all of these, you want to do a little cross beam. Uh, and just, you'll see why. We're going to be putting some upside down stairs. And you don't want to have any exposed grass on the bottom. Why would you do that? Uh, and then up again by three and by three. So this is your base right there check it out pause the screen look at it it's beautiful yes it is okay let's go now next up what we're going to be doing is grabbing some spruce wood stairs and do upside down spruce right here upside down spruce here upside down spruce here and upside down spruce right here look how easy and look how cool you have that stuff on the bottom which is awesome and now get rid of this one let's do one more right there get rid of all of these guys right now get rid of them all Okay, and you can put any material you want here. Uh, you know what? Let's just put dark oak for now. It's fine. I think on the other one I have regular oak, but yeah, it's whatever. You could use anything. Let's put dark oak for now. Okay. Now, if you want to separate it like we have here, this is how you do it. Put a, a, a upside down stair here, upside down stair here, and a slab in the middle, and you have a, a little bench right there. Or you can leave it open. Up to you. All right. Now, next up, let's put some cobble walls here, here, and there. Okay. Now, next up. Let's start working on that little roof uh, pattern. So first off, you want to put a slab here. Want to put two stairs here, another slab, two more stairs, and a slab. Okay. Now let's go up by two, up by two, and then stay right there. Don't you touch nothing else. Okay. Now let's do it again up here. Again, same thing. Up by two, up by two, and don't touch that. Okay. Now let's go here. Up by two, and up by two, and again. Do not touch that there. I'll show you why. Now, we're going to put some stairs right here of dark oak facing inward. And then here, we're going to do a placeholder block. Put a, a pop-out log here. Take the placeholder out. And then run a line of that log going all the way down to here. Popping it out. One from this side and one from this side. All right, cool. Now, let's put a uh, another log, but up here facing up here and here. And then leave that there for now. Now, let's grab our trap doors. And we're going to put trap doors right here. Oh, no, that's not a trap door. Uh, trap door here, 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 and there. Another one here, here. Uh, no, there, and then there, and match it. Sorry, I missed the place and everything. So match that right there, perfect. And then grab our uh, wooden, beautiful oak fence. And just go bam, bam, bam. Drop it all the way in the back. And on top of these, I'm going to put some of the dark oak slabs. Look at that. How nice. Now, another thing you want to do for details, uh, grab a button, put it on that exposed log. 
Grab the other button, put it on that exposed log right there. Perfect, okay, perfect. Now, Lou, look at this, watch this. Now, grab these trap doors. We're gonna go right here, right up against this. We're gonna go one, two, three, and one in the middle. And then lift that up, and it's gonna make that little look to it. It looks so nice. Now, do it again on this side. Bam, bam, bam. One in the middle. Lift them all up, perfect. And do it again on this side. One, two, one, two. Again, we're gonna go up by two on this one fully, like that. And then right on this part, come with me. Let's go inside now. We're gonna cover this part up by putting some upside down uh, stairs, not there, right there. <laughs> We're gonna put them on the inside, upside down, perfect. Look at that, looking nice. Now come back on the outside, let's check this out. Only other little thing you wanna do, drop some trap doors here, lift them up, just to give it a little bit of a, of a nice look to it in the back right there, perfect. We don't really need to dress this back part that much, but that's pretty good. Now, next, do some details on the inside. So watch the details here. This is gonna be cool. So let's do, uh, right now we're gonna do a stair here, okay? And then we're gonna do a slab there, all right? Now, take that one away. We're gonna do a stair here, a slab there, okay? Now, get rid of that piece, and we're just gonna replace it with the dark oak right there, okay? So you can just see it just like that. Come inside here, we're gonna go one more, so just a space of one, bam, drop that. Put that bad boy in there. And then we're gonna do trap doors here, here, and there. And then now put another trap door here, here, and there. That is cool, I love that. Now, we can even do a trap door here and there, and that looks so nice, I love this. I love that that ceiling, that is so detailed, I love it. Uh, now, little bits we're gonna do now, it's pretty simple. Just grab a button, a wooden button this time. We're gonna drop this uh, stair right here, stair right here, and this is the way you can get in right now with a trap door. Hello, trap door. Give it to me. Bam. Bam. Okay, perfect. Now, let's grab banners. You can do any banner of your choice. I made these cool ones. So we could drop this banner here. But this is how we're going to do it. First, we're going to grab a trap door. We're going to put a trap door here and there. Okay, you see that? Now, this is where it connects. So we're going to connect it to that, connect it to this, and connect it to that. Look how nice. Okay, now let's go back on this side. Drop a trap door right there so it can connect okay so we're gonna do a banner here here and there and look how cool see because this little trap doors are here it gives it that cool little look so it's just a little banner right there so nice if you wanted to you can even go crazy drop banners all around here you can if you want to go a little lower uh you can drop some banners here but I, i'd rather have this little overhang so for the overhang i'm just gonna do trap door trap door trap door trap door lift it above uh, that and it looks like that a little a little um uh, a nice little uh, uh, awning, it's called, is that what it's called? And then we have that right there, weighs in from both sides. Now you can fill it in with whatever it is you want right here. I would put some, maybe some glow, so if you have it available underneath this, cover it up with the carpet, or you could just put torches up. If you want to put a torch, put it up on these corners. Uh, and then last but not least, I'm just gonna throw, just for added detail sake, buttons on the top parts of these logs going all the way around, just like this just it and that's it <laughs> that's all there is to it what do you guys think of this one let's take a spin 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 oh i love it oh man this is so cool uh and then like we did over here you can put a bunch of junk in there pack it up with as much things you want or have them specialized maybe just flowers or pots or or anvils or whatever you want to sell that's your little market stall it's ready to go <laughs> but that's it that's all there is to it. Super easy. I'm out of here for now. Thank you for watching, everybody. Uh, let me know if you got any ideas of other builds you want me to try out down this row, and I got you. Oh, look at that village over there. I might go over there and do another village upgrade. We'll see. <laughs> but uh, uh, thank you for watching, everybody. Uh, this has been Mythical Sausage, your 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 uh, builder extraordinaire who builds all kinds of markets uh, in, 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 for you. I'll go to your world and build it for you. No, I won't do it. Okay, bye. See you guys on the next uh, episode. Bye bye bye. See you later. The, this. What? It looks so nice. Look at this texture. Okay, bye. It looks like I was throwing cookies at you. Okay, bye.